Welcome to day two of Pwn to Own and our 10th anniversary. Today we have a record 17 entries happening on a single day. So many in fact that we've divided it into two tracks. Track A focuses on Adobe and Microsoft products, while track B looks at Mozilla and Apple products. Our day started with 360 security team looking at successfully exploiting Adobe Flash by using a use after free bug, two Windows kernel info leaks, and an uninitialized Windows kernel buffer to elevate through Flash to system level access. They were unable to complete their VMware escape as part of their bonus portion, but what they did demonstrate still counts as a win and netted them 40,000 in cash and 12 Master of Pwn points. Over in track B, the day started with Tencent Security Team Shield deciding to withdraw their attempt to exploit Apple Mac OS. Back in track A, Tencent Security Team Sniper, Team Lab, and PC Manager successfully exploited Adobe Flash by using a UAF and escalating to system via a UAF in the Windows kernel. This earned them $40,000 and 12 more points for Master of Pwn. Over in track B, 360 security team continued their successful Pwn to own by elevating privileges on Apple Mac OS by using an info leak and a race condition in the kernel. In doing so, they garnered $10,000 more and three more points for Master of Pwn. In track A, Tencent security Lance team successfully exploited Microsoft Edge by using a UAF in Chakra, then elevating to system by using a UAF in the Windows kernel. This earned them $55,000 and 13 Master of Pwn points. Back in track B, the 360 security team had another successful event as they exploited Apple Safari through an integer overflow and escalated to root using a Mac OS kernel UAF. This garnered them another $35,000 and 11 more points for Master of Pwn. In track A, Tencent security SOAR team actually had their entry disqualified since the bugs they used had already been reported and were known to the vendor. The bugs were reported yesterday in an earlier Pwn to Own entry. Over in track B, the Chetain Security Research Lab succeeded in elevating their privileges in Mac OS by using an info leak in an out of bounds bug in the Mac OS S kernel. In doing so, they netted another $10,000 for themselves and three more points for Master of Pwn. Back in track A, despite their earlier success, Tencent Security Lance team decided to withdraw their entry targeting Microsoft Windows. Back in track B, the next event actually ended in a disqualification, as the Tencent Security Team Sniper targeted Apple Mac OS with bugs already reported to and known by the vendor. In track A, Tencent Security Team Shield decided to withdraw their entry targeting Microsoft Edge with a system level escalation. In track B, Moritz Judolt from Blue Frost Security attempted to target Mozilla Firefox, but failed to get his exploit chain working within the allotted time. In track A, undaunted by any previous events, Tencent Security Team Sniper completed their exploit of Microsoft Edge with the UAF and Chakra and escalated to system level privileges with the UAF and the Windows kernel. This round won them $55,000 at 14 points towards Master of Phone. In track B, the team from Chetain Security Research Lab wrapped up their successful first appearance in a Pwn to Own by exploiting Mozilla Firefox with an integer overflow and escalated privileges through uninitialized buffer in the Windows kernel. This earned them $30,000 and nine Master of Pwn points from this round and increased their total to $90,000 and 26 Master of Pwn points for the entire contest. They certainly made an impression in their first Pwn to Own competition. We hope to see them again in the future. Back in track A, the folks from 360 Security successfully exploited Microsoft Windows with an out of bands bug in the Windows kernel. This netted them $15,000 and four Master of Pwn points. In the final entry for the day in track B, Tencent Security Team Sniper successfully exploited Apple Safari through an integer overflow and escalated to root via an out of bounds UAF in Windows Server. This netted them $35,000 and 11 points for Master of Pwn. In the final event for Track A and the final event for Day 2, Tencent Security Team Sniper elevated privileges in Microsoft Windows through an integer overflow in the kernel. This final act of Day 2 earned them $15,000 and four more points for Master of Pwn. This brings an end to another fascinating day of Pwn to Own 2017. The race for Master of Pwn remains tight, with two teams still in the running. Be sure to join us tomorrow for all the results in the final of the Master of Pwn in this 10th anniversary edition of Pwn to Own.